No, the microphone's there, you dumb dingo. Oh, what? Oh, wait. It's giving you, you the headphones. You what? stupid idiot! Why did you feel the need to point out the microphone? When you well, because I thought it was like, it was like speaking to the, uh, to the headphones. I'm like, that's where I hear the sound. I don't make the sound from there, you big dummy. Okay. Hey! Spider-Man. Okay, Sunset Uista. Here we are. <laughs> oh, no, this is actually... We're in for a bad time. <laughs> I like how every time. Play Sunset Vista. You're gonna have a bad time. Okay, it looked like he was humping the crates from where I could see. Because it's like, Crash, you are nasty, nasty little boy. Oh god. And I you love guys, it. you guys ready? What? Oh no! <laughs> crash! Dun. Oh! Uh, crash by name. Crash by nature. Oh, where are those? Why were you doing the Jaws thing? What? No, I was doing Flash Gordon. Crash! Uh, crash! Oh, crash! Crash! Ah! <laughs> He's a failure. He's hey, an okay guy. Oh, just call that so kindly brought up Jaws, all-time favorite <laughs> film. Really? So fucking no, good. Not Reservoir Dogs anymore. No, Jaws took it. Oh my god. Jaws took it. Jaws took the cake and it fucking ate it too. <laughs> do you have any more lemonade, dear? I do, but I have to go downstairs to get it. Fuck it. We'll do it at the end of the episode. Oh, wow. You can have water like a good boy. I already had water. You can have more enough. water. You can never have I enough water. I don't want any more water. I want lemonade. <laughs> I want to be bloated. <laughs> I want to be bloated and fat, please. No, I'm just thinking of oh, Inside Lewin Davis. Bloat my Why? fat little carcass This is one up. part when a character goes, um, he says, um, Cincinnati. Yeah. I'm just thinking lemonade. The Illuminati. No, Lemonati, because that's how you... <laughs> Lemonati. <What>? No. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's what I like. Oh, okay, yeah. let's... By the way, you know... Okay, Illuminati. Let's talk about another little fucking cringe little thing. Um, well, that was life. No, no, Anonymous. Okay, because like, the thing is, like, okay. Anonymous, I've seen their videos now, and all they do is shit talk. What, Anonymous? Yeah. yeah, all they're just like, Donald Trump, I'm gonna get you. I'm like, well, then just get him, Anonymous. The <laughs> point is, you don't announce this shit, you just do it. Like, cause, like, the whole thing about Anonymous is like, it could be any one of us, but like, if you make it a group, then you're like, isn't that defeating the po po purpose? Cause like, now Anonymous is now synonymous with something. So like... You're just rapping it. Ah! <laughs> ah! Ah! Like, anonymous is now synonymous with something, so fuck that shit, you know? Like, that doesn't make any sense. So why are you getting multiple turns here? Cause um, he's a dirty Because one. Lavelle probably don't want to play, you probably want to talk. Yeah, because I'm a dirty little bitch and that's yeah. all I'm good at. And it's one of the harder levels, so I wouldn't want the person with the least experience with doing it. Because yeah. we've got to get through it. Yeah. we got to get all this melons out. I've been playing this game since before you what? were born. What? The fuck? You're hearing it to the back. Wow. I don't come that far. With, with, that, with that button right there. <laughs> you pushed a button and you died, you fucking idiot. Press X to die. <laughs> Press X to pay, pay respects. <laughs> I actually did like that campaign. That one was the better one. Um, I like oh, all the Black Ops games. Movies. Yeah? Black Ops games are good. I mean... The Black, Black Ops 2 campaign was pretty shit, Black but... Ops 2 actually was the only one with, like, a divergent, like, chooser and adventure shit. And I was like, mm. that's weird Ooh. Call of Duty. Why would you do um, that? Um, Black Ops 3, I feel like it had a good Oops. campaign, but I would have done it differently. How would you have done it, Sleeman? Tell me how you would have done it. I feel like as the game went on, um, kind of spoilers here, but nobody cares about the plot in a Call of Duty game. Yeah. Like... There was no real connection to the rest of the Black Ops games. Yeah. Yeah, because Black Ops 2 was like the whole like connected to Black Ops 1. Black yeah. Ops 3 was like, we're cyborgs now. I liked all that stuff as well. They had this really cool thing where you play the first level and you're just like normal human. But then at the end of the level, you get your limbs and body like ripped apart by this robot. And you get kind of PTSD from it. Yeah. Because the way that the, um, I think it's like the DNI thing or whatever, yeah. when you get your cybernetic implants, you can play while I'm talking. Because <laughs> yeah. um, I'm going to get into this. Um, oh boy, Call of Duty discussion, that's what I want to Because I feel like Black like Ops 3 like, had really good story, if not it had really good potential for a good story. Which is not something you usually find in a Call of Duty game. Yeah, that's fair. That's um, fair. yeah, you get PTSD. Yeah, you like the way the DNI thing works is mm. it um it's this neural oh, link that connects your um your cybernetics to your mind oh, so yeah. you can control them. Yeah. But if you were to have a flashback, like a full in Vietnam flashback, 
when you've got the um, the DNI thing, I don't even know that's the fucking term for it, like hooked into you, yeah. you actually relive that memory again, so you have to go through the pain and everything. Yeah. I was waiting for that to come up again after they brought it up once, but it didn't. When it only came Shit. up once? It came up once, they explained what it was, and it was never done with again. What? <laughs> Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're talking about the top 10 games that dropped its really cool concepts. There's, there's, some, there's a video something like that. Yeah. See, like, like, had a good they do a video for everything. Yeah, See, like, GTA story. 5 I felt was, like, just a massive, like... Oh, no, I love GTA It was GTA like a... 5. No, I, li I liked it, but, like, every now and again I was like, Oh, that's a good plot point, and then it's just like, No, more wacky fun. I'm like, look, Saints Row has already got you beaten in that one. Don't just... Just go back to GTA 4. Mm. Like, because I actually did... Like, GTA 4 satire was funny to me, because it was, like, all this serious oh, stuff, and then, and then, like, the ads were like, Do you like big dicks? But GTA 5, the whole thing was like, we are Americans and we're bad. I'm like, well, like, you can't really say that when it took you like 50 fucking million to make the game, you capitalist scum. You can't make fun of capitalism if you're capitalist, you little shits. I mean, you can, but like... Uh, <laughs> I did it again. But like, it's Oops, GTA 5. I did it again. We just said the wrong, We just said it at the same time. Should, you guys should fuck. Well, Actually, um, show another one of those photos honest. again, please. <laughs> right now, I want to see a fuck like, and then, I don't know, draw a dick on it. Oh, uh, man, you I, have, you I, have to I, edit this, so you have to... Yeah, no, I know, I'm not going to draw a dick on it, but I know exactly what photo to put up. That's a recent one, too. Is that one with a dick? You gotta, no. you gotta put up the photo of us both wearing the Game of Thrones shit. shirt. Oh, yeah, that's, that's gonna go on there. And then, what was the other shirt? The Pulp Fiction shirt. If I ever had a relationship so pure as it was... <laughs> No, literally, we're just doing a theatre show together, and I go out, you know, oh, I'm at Kmart, I'm gonna buy this Game of Thrones shirt, it looks cool, and then I wear it to the theatre, and Jared's wearing the same fucking shirt. And one of you's like, we have to go home and change. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and, and the funny thing is then, um, well, when I bought the Game of Thrones shirt, I also bought a blue Pulp Fiction shirt, and then I saw, no. his mom, I saw Jared's mum at the theatre, and she's like, Oh, I heard you had the same shirt as Jared. That's funny. I bought Jared a shirt today. It's a blue Pulp Fiction one. You're like, you Wouldn't you know? Same one. Same. And one. then, um, then our friend Tian bought us the same shirt for Christmas. <laughs> and that's a red Pulp Fiction shirt. We've got to keep it going. Yeah. Fucking hate you. Yeah. Um, they actually hook you up into a simulation of this terrorist attack yeah. that happened. And at the end, they go, "Can you imagine?" what it would have been like if we had this technology then. We yeah. could have avoided this whole tragedy, yeah. but we didn't, so all these people died. And that was pretty cool. But then he's, the whole thing, like he it. said it would have been cool <laughs> if they load you up into a, like a um, earlier Call of Duty level from yeah. like Black Ops 1 or something. Yeah. And it's like, ah, oh, look at the level you already know, but with the new gameplay. I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah, like, you, like it has like huge bits where you can like literally like because you have cybernetic energy, you can just jump over one bit or yeah, like, exactly. climb something. Oh yeah, that's a problem with Call of Duty. They're still using the same engine from Modern Warfare. They've always like but the same engine is like well, it's you, modern. It's actually, you know what the funny thing is though? Yeah. Modern Warfare. Guess oh, what? what the guess what engine it's still <laughs> using? Uh, Quake threes. Oh god, you're Call of Duty right. has been using Quake threes engine for too Shit. long. Guess how. Uh, I think Quake 3 engine was like 2001. I think around then. Yeah, that's a long ass engine. Like, everyone likes to give shit to the Source engine, but I'm like... I mean, it's not but I think that Source engine is... it. The engine itself is good, and the graphics still look fine. Engine, yeah. he's not into a Crash Bandicoot I'll too. I'll fucking kill you. Oh, yeah, the way for the fire to go. No shit. <laughs> shit. Huh? Well, Poopy jokes. Well, guys, are we hilarious? <laughs> 42, that's the fucking thing of- Oh, what? That's my favourite number. Uh, every- um, No, I, I don't- I don't know, those. Any anyone who makes the 42 joke, I'm just like, that's in, like, I just know you're total trash. If anyone makes a 42 <laughs> joke, I'm like, oh, you're, you're trash, okay. Back, back into Senor Bin you go. I don't know, it's like right up there with like the keep calm and- this shirt, like, I'm like, if you wear one of those, I'm like, you don't want to make a 69 joke before. <laughs> yeah, I know, I'm cool with that because I'm like, at least it's dirty, at least I get something <laughs> out of it. At least There's I, some at to least I get like a raging hard on from thinking about like a dick and also virgine. <laughs> this, I get nothing. All I get is cringe. Speaking of cringe, life is strange. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah, However, it is cringe. Except for the final the game. E except for the cringe bits, was like, yo, home skillet. I'm like, these are French 50 year olds oh. being like, this is how 20 year old girls, like, no, 14 year old girls. Speak. It's, it's an episodic kind yeah. of. Episodic. 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 Episodic the Hedgehog. Episonic <laughs> Underground. Gotta release episodes fast. It's, it's pretty cool. I like I like the idea, and I feel like they've done shit, it all shit, right. Shit, shit, shit. 
in the game. But the whole final episode was just total shit. See, but, like, the thing about, like, using Telltale as an example, shouldn't they just be like, yeah, episodic isn't working? Because, like, they're just like, yeah, we'll release it in three months. I'm like, look, guys, it's not working. Just admit it. Like, Dude, it's... when I fucking bought the season pass for that, when it, well, like, when, like, the first episode came out for Life is Strange. Yeah. Because, like, at the time, I was just like, <laughs> what? fucking Telltale games? Yes, please. See, really? Episode one was the worst. I was like, this is so, this is like, I too love teen drama. But then episode two came out, I'm like, Oh, this is pretty good. One thing I don't like is they don't explain time. Like, one thing I hate about time travel things is it immediately fucks up the plot yeah. all the time. Yeah. Unless you make it really simple. Like, it's like, if you go back in time, this will happen. Like, butterfly effect shit. That's um, okay. A really, really good time travel what movie butterfly is butterfly effect? <laughs> no, no, I'm talking like the butterfly effect, the concept. Not well, you know, I think the movie itself was Oh, like, no, the, the movie's a fucking the mess. plot of holes. Them. Like, I love the movie. Oh, yeah, with the whole, like, stigmata, like, oh, Yeah, Jesus, yeah, why did it the... suddenly just appear? Oh, wow. Well. Well, there you go. well done. Well I done. I didn't bore the bottom there, I was saying. <laughs> By Jesus Christ himself. Because <laughs> Sneaky it's a Christmas, Christmas miracle. And the Christmas miracle is inside of us all along. No. Oh, shit. <laughs> no. The, no. Mir <laughs> the miracle <laughs> was the miracle of friendship. Well, man, you gotta chill out. <laughs> Chilly dogs. Chilly dogs? Why are you Sonic? No. Hold that, stop waiting there, you've got to just go. I oh, know, waiting's bad. It's, I, get, I have to wait for the platform to come out. Oh, yeah, this game's just is waiting! It was <laughs> out, though. It wasn't that. This is what people came in to see us arguing. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> They're just like, yeah, fucking fight for my love, <laughs> you dirty, dirty little vix. <laughs> Look at him. Bye! Bye! I like how when you die, he just goes. He's <laughs> <laughs> like, well, my planet needs me. <laughs> <laughs> No. Oh yeah, that's another cool thing in this game. Yeah. Um, the closer you get to the third island, yeah. the bigger Cortex's castle is in the background. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. That's actually is really cool. So like, when you get to the level just before the castle, it's like, you're right next to it. Just gaming things when the castle's right next to you when you play the game. And Only 90 kids will remember this. If you weren't born in the 90s, you weren't a kid at all. You literally came out of the womb 20 years old. Were you born an adult? No. It's so hard. Uh, everything was better in the 90s. If you're not in the 90s, there is nothing worth living for. You should tell I me. hate children. I'm glad I never was one. I was- I came out of the womb seven, no! six years old. I pay taxes immediately. I was like, please mother, I would like some money for taxes. <laughs> please mother, where are the vegetables? That was a chance. Was it? Yeah, I don't know. Get out of here. That was a chance then. Good thing you told me afterwards. You only get one shot. One opportunity. Yeah, that's when you gotta go in. Enjoy the animation. Go now. But these purple. Well, you can't see because the fingers are there. Go, do it, do it, do it. Wait, now. Well, it's a tricky one. Oh, yeah, baby. You just gotta run yeah, this one. That's easy. Shit, fuck. This get the oogie boogie. <laughs> this is a nightmare. Get the oogie boogie, man. Shit! Oh, if, I swear to God, if you fucking. I'd be like, well. <laughs> well, time to kill myself. Horvat is dead to me now. I, You are dead. You are not getting any Christmas cards. Why are you Indian? <laughs> I just was doing a normal voice, but now you had to put a race into it. Okay, that's cool. I see uh, how it is. Let, let's just everyone ignore that hate crime from Horvat. Uh, <laughs> by the way, his address is for the audience who are offended. Shit! <laughs> No, it's not shit. His address I just, is. I just appreciate. There should be a meme right there. <laughs> what? Because I just leaked your address. You don't know my address. I'll figure it out. <laughs> with the with the power of Google, Matt. Hey Horvat, what's your address? <laughs> uh, Rachel. Ah! Don't actually say your address, <laughs> you idiot. Yeah. Now we gotta cut that out. Why? We could just beep it. We give a shit. Horvat. What if people are like, oh, it's Eggy's house then? Fucking, the Canadians listen to this. Yeah, but at the same time, you, you just don't want to put it out there. There's like, information you just don't want online. Yeah. Like, how much I like wearing women's underwear. Shit, okay. Fuck. Well, we don't know how much, we just know that there is a level. It's a good level. <laughs> it's a level. It's an underwater level. Fuck, I hate those. <laughs> it's an underwater level, because I'm always wet. <laughs> For <laughs> women's yeah. underwear. Why do you do a poop sound when you do the crash, man? <laughs> crash makes me poo. <laughs> crash making me poo! <laughs> crash is my natural lexicon. 
<laughs> Yo, man, are you crazy? Can I like make? No. You got greedy there, little boy. Orvat, what are you doing? You yeah, got greedy. Oh, you're dangerous, Orvat. You don't play by the rules. He's a true maverick. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, this is a long episode. Fourteen minutes. Oh boy, you guys are in for a good time. Sure, that's that's what they're saying. They're probably just like, I just want to go home. <laughs> Why am I? Why are they watching this? Not at home, evidently. <laughs> Like, I, I bet this is gonna be one of their videos, like, another one of their friends is like, You have to watch this video, this is the funniest video in the whole world, and like, it's not funny at all, but like, you look at them and they're like, It's good, isn't it? And you're like, this is awful. <laughs> Fuck those friends. <laughs> Fuck those guys. Fuck them guys. Fuck them. Hey! He just opens his mouth, he's like, ready for that big bonus cock. <laughs> <laughs> that bonus boner. Bonus boner. It's TNT Dynamite. Oi. Oh, we're Australian, oh, we had to sing it. <laughs> we're Australian, evidently we sing H ACDC, you fucked it up. You got it. Oh no! You can do it. It's a metaphor. He did Cannot not do it. <laughs> I, did I right. could do it! No, I couldn't. The little train that- I love how he hits the line and just stands like, I'm dying, I'm dying now. <laughs> no, it's that damn for me. <laughs> oh yeah. It's okay, we just can't fail the next level. At all. Well, this, you can't save when you- yeah. We can just do a safe state. Um, yeah, we can. Emulator. Yeah, we can. Does that work? Yeah, but does it, I know you could do it once, but like, when we come back in a week's time. Yes, something. that's how saving works, all that. I don't, yeah, believe, I don't believe you, Steven. <laughs> saving will save the game? No. It's not a quick save, it's a hard save. Just like me. That's easy shit. Oh. So, it even works for the disc? Well, well, we're not saving the disc. We're saving the save. The disc is safe. It's cool. Well, it would be safe if, uh, if you don't break it. I mean, like, you can break it and it would be safe. Like, oh, wait, we're playing CD ROM. I just said, I just asked that! It, let's remember, saving the state, not the actual CD ROM. And also, you can just get the ISO if you want. Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake! And if not, then we'll just have to play every level again! Oh, if that does end up happening, then I'll just speed run through the game. And we can do it. We can just play Crash Bandicoot. No, man, we gotta finish it. No. Like, let's, let's not finish our first game. Yeah, I think it sets a good precedent. <laughs> I, I think it yeah, should be like, until we game. all want to die, then we stop playing. But then again, I always want to die, so that's not oh, so we're all sleeping, so. Well then... We all what are we die. doing? What are we doing? Why, Why are we, are we playing Crash Bandicoot? We should be killing dogs. ourselves. Get in the portal. Whew. Was he just like, oh, another hard He's day. just like, fuck another daily grind. <laughs> he was like, another day at the office. Life is hard. Oh, oh boy, 17 minutes. No. Okay. Well, this isn't an insult to Australian culture at all. Yeah, okay. Koala Kong. Two things, two <laughs> words that I was not expecting together. <laughs> um... Okay, that thing that we're going to do, it's going to be good, or maybe it won't be. Tune in next time. If you don't, well, that's, that's cool too. Uh, bippity bop, the Jews did 9-11.